have some breaking news of my own from over the weekend. I think this one would fit under our Positively Central Coast umbrella. I asked my beautiful girlfriend of three years, Lauren, to marry me, and she said yes. Hi, everyone. I'm Lori. I'm Jill. We're Nils Nils Parents. Parents. <laughs> Today we come together in a place that holds deep significance for the family, the Liney Lodge, to celebrate and prepare for a truly special occasion, the wedding of Neil and Lauren. Thirty-nine years ago, Lauren's parents also, on the eve of their wedding, same day. Marie was getting married to her love, just like Lauren's getting married to her love. As I stand here, we all miss Marie, Lauren's mom. I'm wearing her dress tonight, knowing she's with us. She's proud of the wife you will be. Remember that life is short. Enjoy every day. Always love each other, even if you don't like each other at the moment. And know that your mom is with you. Cheers to the couple. I love you, I love you so much. Your efforts, big and small, have built the foundation for a day that Lauren and Neil will remember forever. Here's to love, family, and the cherished memories we create together. Cheers. Cheers. wedding dress it if I had to guess I would say something with like lacy sleeves maybe or like something that has a little puff to it because she loves the frilly things that puff out so that's what I would have to say and very I would say fitting but also flowy at the bottom she loves that style <laughs> Do you like it? Oh my god, yeah. It's <laughs> incredible. Oh my god, you look beautiful, you look, babe. Yeah, I love it. You look oh, so handsome. I guessed the sleeves. You did. <laughs> oh. Oh. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you? Neil, it has been so effortless to love someone as joyful and optimistic as you. Your passion and zest for life is undeniable. You make the mundane feel exciting and enjoyable. I couldn't be more proud to have the privilege to stand here today to vow my love to you. One of the very first things that drew me to you was the way you carry yourself in a room full of people. You radiate openness in a way that's warm and welcoming. You bring a sense of levity, ease, and humor to every setting you walk into. Simply put, your energy is palpable and infectious. <laughs> okay. My beach and cheese loving <laughs> charcuterie board master, soon to be white. Watching you walk to the security line at the airport on your way to live in Spain for nine months was the most heartbreaking feeling I've ever felt. It felt like we were on the verge of starting something special, so selfishly, I didn't want you to go, but I knew I couldn't hold you back from something you dreamed about. That overwhelming feeling of sadness was the moment I knew I didn't want to live without you. I cried my eyes out in front of your parents on the walk to the car. That was something I did not have on my life's bingo card. <laughs> I felt the love I felt for you then has only grown over the years. Your quick wit and lighthearted humor, your beautiful smile, 
the natural aura and positive light you bring everywhere you go were just a few qualities that caught my attention over half a decade ago. The endless love you share with me and the ones you hold close to your heart fills my heart to the brim. Beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. Lauren, you know your mom is here. That's why it's raining. And we're both so proud of you. But you also know, mom is saying it's about damn time. I would tell her she, she's got a really, really wonderful daughter. And she knew that. Throughout my life, my dad has told me on a few occasions, you better not mess this up. <laughs> With different language normally, but. Well, he said that about you, and although I already knew you were the one for me, I knew my family was ready to call you family. <laughs> you truly are the sweet to my sour, the pepper to my salt, and the olive oil from my sourdough. As you've told me time and time again, if something brings you joy, keep it. And in this case, it's someone who brings me joy. And that someone is you. I love you. It wasn't long after our first date when we found out my mom was diagnosed with cancer. You were with me the night I received the call. It was overwhelming news to process, and at the time, extremely scary to open up and be vulnerable when you're just starting to get to know someone. But as you sat with me that night, I felt a sense of peace I had never felt before. Two years later, when we found ourselves at the night of her transitioning, you were right by my side, again, giving me that same sense of peace at a time that felt so dark, hopeless, and uncertain. I know, with you, I will never have to do anything on my own. I used to never find myself truly present to enjoy the moment because I was always waiting for the next thing to happen. Now that I have you, I don't take a single moment for granted. I am so grateful to have found a partner whose very presence is a reminder of the beauty and brevity of life. All I wanted for my little sister was to be happy. We weren't sure she'd ever get married. <laughs> well, some short time goes by, and I was sitting on the couch with my mom, and we were discussing Neil, and I was asking her what she thought. She told me, Brianna, she's going to marry him. I said, what? <laughs> I said, we haven't known him that long. She said, I know but I just know she's gonna marry him. At that moment, I also knew, because my mom approved, and she always knew, she's with you today, and I wanted to share some of her words so you could hear her voice. Lauren, it's your mom. Love you, bye. And here's to Lauren and Neil, and that they find the joy together in life.
together, we make a pretty great team, and I vow to never keep score. And most of all, I vow to love you for all that you are and all that you have yet to become. When I'm with you, I know why I'm here. Wherever we go, we'll go together. I'll never need a map again, because with you, I'm home. There's no stopping us, won't